guys welcome back to world illuminator 11 i hope you're all having a lovely day and welcome if it is your first time checking out my channel so today we are asking the question how are you feeling how are you really feeling today how are you really feeling in every moment how are you really feeling within yourself and um this is a question that i found coming up for me earlier on this morning you know i woke up and i did my usual you know my gratitude and i did my prayer and i did my meditation and it was all really lovely but instead of just rushing to then uh you know take my phone and start checking my comments and checking my um you know whatsapp and uh, telegram which is what i tend to do um you know i literally just found myself just lying there with my hands on my heart and asking and then this question just came through how are you how are you today and as soon as i asked you know these answers started coming in in my head and it was like oh there was a bit of pain in my leg yesterday we started the sort of the night before and this is something that i know is to do with ascension just my right leg and it was happening the you know uh, quite a bit uh yesterday up into the morning i was like oh my leg is not painful today so that's good it doesn't seem to be so cold today i you know and um, I'm feeling good. I woke up. I slept much better than I did the night before. All these things were sort of coming up in my head and um, and it was all really good. But then still the question came up again. How are you really feeling today? And then I lay there and I quietened down the thoughts. They started sort of quietening down and and I got into a place where I was just listening and and i you could tell that i'd gone from being in the mind to being more in the heart and i lay there for a bit nothing was sort of coming and then i started seeing these colors sort of dancing and as the colors were dancing some green some sort of purple and sort of pinkish you know these colors sort of dancing i really got the message that i was feeling healing i was healing was the first one healing and i am feeling calm and um feeling calm and peaceful and feeling happy you know that those were the words that were coming through from these colors and i realized that i was starting to answer from what is actually going on within me you know what is really going on not the answers that come from the mind when you ask how are you oh i'm, I'm okay i'm doing fine you know even if there are other deeper things that are happening just that sort of yeah i'm okay today you know i woke up okay i slept well so i'm fine it's about asking yourself how you're really feeling within that's the message that i really got that was coming through with that and you know as i said you know we are busy in our day we've got so much to do get up and you know whether if you've got children take them get them ready for school pack lunches and you know start getting ready for work whatever it is that you're doing in your day you do all these things but you don't ask yourself the deeper question of how are you really feeling and the message that I was also really getting was that, you know, it, and they can also be actually another thing of, you know, we all know, especially on this journey, on the spirit, on your spiritual path, on your, on your, um, uh, you know, twin flame journey, that is all about being positive. And, you know, last week I was asked a question by one of our soul sisters, which I answered in a video. Um, do check that out if you haven't seen it about how I stay so positive. And sometimes we can get into this place where it's it's just like oh I, I have to be positive i am positive you know because that's what helps me to to feel good in my life and all these things but there can be so much more going on underneath and you know and for me i am positive and you know as the question was asked but there are always things that i have to work on that are going on underneath and you know and that's about really checking in with yourself and ensuring that you're not just being positive for the sake of being positive because you know you've got to be positive whereas really underneath your being positive is actually covering a lot of other negative emotions and things that may be going on underneath you that's the message that i was really getting with the question of how are you really feeling is there something else going on underneath that you may be covering with just being positive 
because you know you've got to get on with your day because you know you've got to be positive because that's what you know helps you to manifest the things that you desire that's you know that's what you need to do is there something else deeper going on and as i was saying you know i am positive and um and but also they you know when there are things going on underneath I have really learned to not ignore those things. And I did talk about that in the video as well. When I do notice something coming up, I realize that it's trying to tell me something. And, you know, and the fact that it's coming up, it's saying something about me. When someone triggers you, when when you start feeling sadness coming in or you start feeling, you know, certain emotions that you may not associate with being positive coming up for you, it's showing you that something is going on with you. When you start taking things personally, when it comes to your twin flame journey, it's showing you that there's something else that's going on with you. When you start, whatever it is that you start feeling, you know, if, it, if it's that what you consider to be negative is showing you there's something deeper that you need to work on for you to work through it so that you can be able to release it and really get into the place of feeling positive truly rather than just pretending or just uh, working on feeling positive when there's really so much more going on. And that was the question that was coming through. You know, rather than just asking yourself, how am I feeling? Oh, I'm good. I'm going on, you know, and go getting on with your day. How are you really feeling inside? Because that is what really truly matters because, you know, you can get on with things and do all these things. But if you're not dealing with whatever it is that is going on underneath, that is asking you to deal with it, then, you know, then it's all still there. And for you to be able to get into that place of truly feeling positive and truly feeling good in yourself, you know, it is about dealing with those things. So that was the message that was coming through. Make some time for yourself today to really see how you're feeling. And, you know, when I heard the message that I am healing, I really realized that there are still things that I'm still working on deeper within myself, that I'm still healing, you know, when when it comes to my own journey. And one of the things that I actually got when in, rela in relation to that was that I need to pull back from being so much or rushing to check my, um, you know, my comments, check my telegram, check my WhatsApp. I got a message a while ago to put telegram, WhatsApp, you know, all these sort of um, apps on uh, quiet. So I don't get messages from them, but what I've got into a habit, like, like notifications from them, but what I've got into a habit of doing is checking them quite constantly. You know, because I don't hear the ping when a message comes in. I've really got into this habit of always going on to check it. And that was the message that I was getting that, you know, now you, it's about coming back more to yourself. You know, you don't need to be on that um, checking all the time. This was a message for me. And I feel this could be a message for someone else in relation to social media. Maybe you are on social media quite a lot. You know, always checking in to see what's going on out there. The message is you need to come back here. That is where everything is. You know, you are your ascension. You're the one who has to come back to your power, to your divinity, to your inner world. That is where your ascension is. We know we have for so long sort of really thought it's always about going out there to listen to other people, to see what's going on in the world. Um, you know, if when it comes to religion, Religion, listening to priests or to, you know whoever but it's really about coming back to yourself and you know even when it comes to the spiritual worlds it's also about you know not always putting your power out to other people you know uh, and really coming back to yourself you are the one who has to really work on what's going on within so that was the message that was coming through today how are you really feeling within come back to yourself see what's going on with you and if there are things that need dealing with then deal with those things if there's a certain emotion that's coming up for you it's showing you what is going on with you rather than let it go and pretend that you're okay 
or just work on being positive you've got to deal with all that and the more you can deal with that the things that are going on underneath the more you will work through them and actually then be able to get into the place where you do feel more positive within yourself and truly feel that from deep within where you do get into that place of feeling happy within and you know and you're not sort of covering certain things and you know things will always come up something will always come up so the message is when those things come up rather than ignoring them or just pushing them aside deal with them and that is going to help you on your path because if you can't hear those messages that are coming from deep within then it's going to be really hard for you to also then hear you know the messages that are there to guide you on your path and you know when it comes to your own ascension because the guidance is coming through from within the things that you need to do the the messages that are there to help you on your path to take certain steps in your life but you have to be in the place of working through those things that you're feeling within and and hearing what is going on within you and when you do that you open up more of that space in yourself to be able to hear the guidance to be able to know what to do when it comes to certain things to be able to move forward to find the answers to find the clarity that you need when it comes to your own life so that you can keep moving forward on your ascension path so the message is it's all about what's going on within you know rather than being out there too much come back in here and that was what i was getting and that's really changed my view i haven't looked at any comments i you know i haven't looked at any of my whatsapp or, or you, you know i'm gonna do it at certain times and just really give more of coming back to myself i really found that really powerful as a message that was coming through so and and then the other one was i just need to really give myself you know more of needing my own energy more you know rather than being out there too much needing to hear myself more and you know being in the place of understanding myself more not needing that understanding from other people and i realized that this is something that i do you know i'm very um, i approve you know i don't need anyone's approval to do anything i do what i want to do but i really have found out that i am that sort of person who always wants to be understood by other people you know i really want someone else whether it's my mom or my sister or you know other people to understand where i'm coming from so i'm not needing approval but i'm needing that understanding because that will help me to feel like it's okay i can get on with things but i just need my own understanding so these were the answers that i got when i was asking deeper about what it is that i how am i really feeling so those were the things that i am still healing that came up for me today and the message was when you keep doing that coming back more into yourself giving yourself that time to quieten the mind the mind will tell you all sorts of things to start off with by quieting that and then get to a place where you know don't you know it's not like you're fighting to quieten your mind let whatever comes up come up let it all come up and then you get to a point where you get past that you calm yourself even more and you keep calming yourself you know you're not stopping your mind from from thinking you you, you are just letting it all come out but not focusing too much on it and then it calms itself down and you get to that space where you actually hear what's really going on within you that's when you start to hear the messages that are coming through from your soul letting you know what it is that you're still needing to work on healing for yourself that's when you start to hear the messages that are coming through from your heart about certain things that you are wanting to do or needing to do so that was the message how are you really feeling is the question for today go deeper within yourself where there are things that you need to work on whatever is going on with you you know if someone else triggers you if something else is going on with your divine masculine remember it is pointing to what is happening within you you have to come back to see what it is that is making you feel the way that you're feeling it's not about the other person it's showing you what you need to work on within yourself and the message is always go deeper always ask yourself how am i really feeling and always find that answer from deeper within and as you do you can work through those things 
messages so that you release them and then be able to hear more of the messages that are coming through from your soul and more of the messages that are there to help you to move forward on your path. So how are you really feeling today? I hope you have a great day, guys. I'll see you on the next video. Love, peace, positivity, and light.